Welcome back again to Aringa's Kitchen. I have another family favorite recipe and it's called braised red cabbage, Dienstelt Wittisch Komposto. And so all you will need for this recipe is one medium head uh, uh, red cabbage, one teaspoon of salt, one teaspoon of vegeta or vegetable base, uh, half a teaspoon of ground black pepper, three teaspoons of brown sugar, five teaspoons of vinegar, and a quarter cup of vegetable oil. So what I've done is I've put the vegetable oil into a large stock pot. I always like to work with a large stock pot. It just gives me enough room to be able to um, uh, fry down my uh, vegetables or braise the vegetables. So I've uh, heated up some vegetable oil. And then I'm going to add the um, cabbage. So this is the uh, red cabbage. And so I've kind of... Um, cut it up into small pieces, bite-sized pieces. So I'm going to be adding that to the uh, stock pot and then I'm going to be um, um, adding my uh, salt and vegeta and brown sugar and vinegar and pepper to the cabbage and then I'm going to braise it at a medium heat until it's semi-soft uh, texture. So I'm going to do that now. And now this is really great served with pork, especially pork. Do you want to um, add it with pork? And I'm just going to add that in there slowly. And I'm going to braise it. We want it to have a, a semi soft uh, texture to it. And get this going here. Now, um, this is a very, very um, common recipe that would be served with pork, a pork recipe. You can serve it with beef also and fish, sort of like a side vegetable dish. And the cabbage is going to shrink a bit, you know, it looks like a lot, it's like it's a medium um, head of cabbage. And it's going, the cabbage is going to uh, shrink in size as you are um, raising it. And I'm going to add my uh, my spices. So I've got um, I've got some sea salt. Now you can add as much as you as much as you want, you know, if you find that my recipe doesn't have enough uh, of the spices or salt, you can add more, more to it. And just stir that around. You can hear it sizzling already. Want to watch the temperature? It's probably about medium, medium heat. And in the first um, couple minutes, you want to uh, stir it continually. And then um, when you've added all your um, spices and the vinegar and brown sugar, then you can um, just stir it intermittently. And then we've got some ground black pepper. Now it's getting, it's heating up a bit there, that's good. And then you add the, um, this is vegeta, but you can add a, a um, vegetable base of your choice. I like using this specific um, spice. It's got some dried, um, dried uh, vegetables in it too, the ingredients. And it's the MSG free vegeta. Okay, just keep an eye on the heat. Make sure it doesn't burn. And then I've got the brown sugar. I use brown sugar. My mom, mom uses, mom uses brown sugar. You can use regular sugar if you want, the white sugar. But I like to use the uh, brown sugar. And you can add more sugar if you want. If you want it sweeter, um, you can add certainly add to your taste what you like. I'm just going to keep stirring all this, the ingredients in there. And then I've got some vinegar. Just kind of gives it a sour, sort of a sour, sour taste to it. And then I'm going to keep um, braising this until it's kind of a has a semi-soft texture to it. And then what I will do is I will show you how it's served. I've cooked up some uh, pork, and I'll show you how that's served with pork. That's going to be for supper today. So this is kind of like a vegetable side dish. So I'll be back to show you what this great recipe looks like served with, with uh, meat. 
Welcome back again to Rinka's Kitchen. I had on the stove some uh, braised red cabbage and um, it's called Dienstelt Virish Komposta. So I was uh, braising it on the stove and I braised it until the um, cabbage became kind of like a semi-soft texture. So what I'd like to do is show you what this great side dish recipe looks like. So it's got the beautiful vibrant color of the cabbage and I've just put it into a serving dish so if you are going to be serving this to guests as a side dish you would want to put it in a serving kind of a dish like this and everybody would um, take it, uh, the exact amount that they wanted to so that's what it looks like in the serving dish the present uh, the color is just just beautiful and with the oil it makes it kind of nice and shiny and also um, all the spices in that that uh, are added into it make this a very flavorful uh, side dish. So I'm just going to show you what this looks like on a plate with meat. So this is pork. This is my pork recipe from the website um, that you could use or any of your favorite um, pork recipes that you want or you can serve it with beef also and fish. So uh, for dinner tonight um, this is what I will be serving with some rice and uh, pork and just as a um, vegetable side dish this is what this great recipe looks like so if you have any questions or comments about the recipe uh, for this um, particular recipe you can uh, go to my uh, website uh, irinkaskitchen.com or um, also you can email me at Irene at irinkaskitchen.com. Until next time, bon appetit, yo etvadiot.